previously on The Block. As Jane and Matt's wedding approaches, the bridal party arrives from Melbourne. Oh, my God. And the celebrations begin. I'm very nervous. As the renovating pressure increased, so too did the tension within the couples. I just need to chill out for a second and just think about this. I just don't think I don't know what you're talking clutter. about. What? I don't know what you're talking about. In the midst of all of this drama, a new couple walk right into the eye of the storm. Oh my god. Tonight on The Block. It's room delivery day and everyone's feeling the pressure. He doesn't trust me with the paint. <laughs> disappointing, very disappointing. I know I'm a ball breaker, but what's wrong? Why isn't it done? It's all right, Kirsten. You get your own paint. Oh, this is crap. I can't deal with that thing anymore. But the final results are well worth the effort. The Block oh. is open for inspection. Oh, my God. Wow, this is beautiful. You're going to be hard pressed to beat this. But wait, there's more. This is a little test job. So I can't get over the toilet in the doorway. Yeah. Well done, no, good. that's good access, good access. <laughs> <laughs> Our bedroom kicks butt on this. Whoa, is anyone else shocked by that? I do feel, and I hope they feel the same way, ours is better. Each of our couples has a finished room in their apartments, and they're all bedrooms, so at least they have a clean place to sleep at night. But what none of them have yet are bathrooms, and that is a major inconvenience. Apart from Jamie and Andrew, everyone's delivering a bathroom next, and they can be an expensive room to get right. Drew, do you know where the toothpaste is? I have no idea. Oh, why do I wear black? <laughs> Joke. At the moment, Kirsten and Jason have the most amount of budget left. Having won $5,000 worth of plumbing electrical services from AGL, they now have $62,430. Jamie and Andrew were left with the remaining budget after Danny and Monique delivered their bedroom, leaving them $61,094 to spend. Matt and Jane have $60,108 left. And Richard and Stephen have $58,693 to spend. They've only got 60 hours to deliver their next rooms. Plenty of time for things to go down the toilet. Today, a Sparky dropped a drill on our toilet, which was already installed. But I'll come, come and I'll show you the crack he made in the toilet. And because it's all one piece, we need a whole new unit. And he's paying for it. Look at that. Stuffed. And it was a brand spanking new toilet. And I was ready to use it. You're feeling a lot more confident now with the... We've got bathroom after one day. We finally got our Tyler on the job. He's doing a great job. I just wish he would have done it a week ago. <laughs> a couple of weeks ago, Matt hired his plasterers. And I said, are you a plasterer? And he said, yes. And I said, are you looking for Matt? And he said, I don't speak any English. So I turned to the next one and I said, oh, he doesn't speak any English. And he said, I don't speak a word, not a word. So I didn't know what to do. <laughs> uh, Borsch. <laughs> <laughs> 
Ah! Yeah. Okay. Bosch. Can anyone speak Russian down there? Two weeks later, Matt hasn't picked up much Russian, but he is learning the universal language of tradesmen. Yeah, and they, the, it's all finished. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, I finish, uh, yeah. So the, do the painters just sand that over? Or? I don't know. In my bosses. Okay. Yeah. No worries. Alex has finished the plasterer, the Russian, but I'm not really sure what he's done. Something about a boss, no finish, smile. Um, maybe tomorrow, something. Doesn't speak a lot of English. And if I put those words together, I don't like the sentence. <laughs> I asked him to sand the ceiling, but it wasn't his job, but I just uh, hope I'd sneak that through. But the smart Russian's on to me, isn't he? Is this master floor sanding? Hi, my name's Andrew. I'm one of the, the guys down at the block in Manly. We're in desperate need of a floor sander. So, I need to try and find one that can sand our floor at one o'clock tomorrow afternoon. Is there any chance of getting that down? Can we make a 350 cash? 400 cash. All right. None of them are keen to come down to the price that we need them to come down to. I'm going to have to go back in there and find someone else. I don't think I'm happy with 400. After a month of living, working and renovating in a new city, Matt's mind still turns to home and the most important event of his life. Well, what dawned on me at work this afternoon was that in three weeks from Saturday, I'm actually getting married. And uh, yeah, I found myself here and I thought I needed a new suit to get married in. Um, Jane's gonna look amazing. I'm gonna get emotional even talking about this. Oh. <laughs> Jane's going to look amazing and I'd love to look as good for her on the day, so I'd love to buy a really, really, really good suit so that um, she's as blown away uh, by me as I will be by her. Oh. <laughs> I'm getting really emotional thinking about this wedding now. Yeah, exciting. Hi, how are you going on that? I was looking for a suit. That's a traditional tuxedo, or there's a pinstripe suit. Is that the one in the window? It's the same one in the window. Yeah, I like that. Oh, this is, this is great. I think this is May. More you? Yeah. I hope she's blown away by this. I think this is the one. This is definitely the suit I want to get married in. Well, it's Friday evening, six o'clock. And that means for most people, maybe having a social drink to wind down after a hard week at the office, or catching up with family and friends and getting ready for a relaxing weekend off. Not for our couples. It means they have to get cracking as they now have less than 48 hours to finish their rooms. Painter's not here. And he's nearly two hours late, and we've yeah we've come to the conclusion that we're not going to have him anymore. <laughs> I'm just going to start painting, and I'm starving. Just going to stock up on some chockies and a drink, and that'll keep me going. It's really weird. You just you have to keep going because you know how much work you have to do. So I feel fine. I've only had two hours sleep. <laughs> and hopefully the painter will arrive and I won't make too much of a mess. Knock, knock. Oh my god! I hope you like chicken and cashew nut. Thank you so much. Awesome. Yeah. If you want a hand, give us a call. She's on her own tonight, the poor love, so we kind of um, got her some dinner so she could get started on her painting and offered our services because we're kind of... Well, we were going to paint in here, but we can't really paint. But I said to her, if she wants a hand painting, I'm more than happy to give her a hand because she must be really feeling um, quite, I don't know, poor thing. She must be feeling a bit of pressure. Still no painter. What's the time? Nine o'clock? 
Oh my god. <laughs> I'm going to be honest with you, I was a little nervous when Jamie said she'd started the painting, but I thought it's amazing what you can do with a sanding block. And I wasn't about to tell her not to. She's painted before and she's done a good job of painting before. I'm just going to have to work around it because I don't have time not to. Oh, this is crap. It's too big. I don't know what she's like with a roller. I haven't seen much roller work. I'm sure she's fine. Oh, this is crap. <laughs> I can't deal with that thing anymore. Oh, there's a car. Maybe it's my paint. Thank God. <laughs> <laughs> you don't understand, I'm ruining walls. <laughs> But it is a relief to hear that the painters have showed up. At the moment, back on schedule. Yep. Due to council noise restrictions, our couples aren't allowed to make any noise or fire up a power tool before 8 a.m. You're great on the surfboard. Look how cute you are. So Matt, Richard and Stephen take the opportunity to have an early surf. Yes! Oh. Last night our painters turned up a couple of hours late and they finished about an hour ago so we haven't had any sleep. I've just been feeling sick for about the last hour because I've been thinking I really should get up and have a look at it. Oh, that colour's as green as I thought it was going to look. We need some light. Oh, that's horrible. It's exact green we didn't want. It's horrible. <laughs> it looks like a lolly. It does. Are we going to change it? I don't know. We need to get some daylight in here. I would have liked to not have to worry about changing that colour. Mm. Let's go back to bed. <laughs> At least Andrew found a floor sander to come in on Saturday. Hopefully, they'll be happy with his work. Meanwhile, Jason and Kirsten are off to spend the $5,000 prize they won for their first room. Can you show me the actual pieces that are involved in it? I am so excited. We just it's got for $5,000, we got our whole cooktop range. Under, under bench oven? Yep. Cooktop yep. and overhead fan. Which is sensational. But you're one of the lucky ones, aren't you? And we got, and we got <laughs> the five grand yeah. of services Congratulations. as well. Congratulations. Yeah. Well done. Yeah. Well done, honey. Cool. It's all coming together. Yeah. With the help of their imported Melbourne builder Trent, Matt and Jane are fitting a laundry into their bathroom. Or at least they're trying. Are you sure this definitely fits? 
<laughs> Does the door have to come off? Yeah. Far out. Is that going to fit? Yeah, 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 it would. That'll look good. Yeah, that's Which what I just want. just fit in. Well, you don't need it to be that big. You want it today? Yeah, it's got to go in today. Yeah. What's that? Unfortunately, there's not one left. I've we need left left hand. We I've definitely right left. Hand and it would Do be we definitely need left? Yeah. If you turned it upside down... We don't recommend it. Well, that's a bugger, isn't it? Heated towel rail. Just want to see if you've got any in stock. Turn yeah, it right. upside down. No, that's what we're just talking oh, about. Yeah, using that Up, one. But using it upside down, yeah, yeah. it's still going to get condensation and moisture, and that's what they're talking about it not being covered on warranty necessarily. You can't do that. You can't. Right. Okay. Let's do just the other one. Get the, other. the other one's nice anyway, and the other one's not so busy in terms of the. Now you're happy to have that instead of the. Uh... I'd like a heated one, Jase, but we don't have a choice. Well, we do. We can do it upside down. Huh? We can well, do I don't it. want to hang it upside down. No, no. no, no. the answer is no. no. I love that. Yeah, so do I. Oh, hang on. Does Jason and Kirsten have that? I think they might. <laughs> yep. Good. They're 129, the square ones. Yeah, that's not a square, is it? No. Nah. But I kind of like the rectangle. I, just, I think two squares would look better. Well, OK, do we... Oh, she can make decisions. No. Jamie can make decisions. Just she likes everything. It'll work itself out. It always does. Sure? It's not lots of fun. Where's their folders? Where did you put it? Oh, my God, Andrew, you were walking around with them. Oh, my God. Again, <laughs> we've left the folders somewhere. So, we've lost on. folders, sorry. We... Hang on, you stay here, Oliver. Yeah, they're probably on the counter. Just talk there. Oh, yeah. Sorry. It's just everything we need. It's in the folder. And I don't know where the folders are. You know what? I reckon I know exactly where they are. Right where I left them. I don't even remember being here. The good old folders. Like her fiancé, Jane also has the wedding on her mind. How cute are they? Oh my gosh. Cute I could go crazy in here. Yes, I was thinking something maybe a little bit more minimal. That's probably a bit tizzy. This one here. See, I don't want anything too wedding-ish. I won't tell you the price of this. <laughs> no, tell me. Huh? 2800 <gasps> They're just wild. I said to Matt last night, I'm just feeling really excited now and really proud that we're getting married and we're going to be husband and wife in three weeks. <laughs> what do you think? Do you like those? They're amazing, though. Yeah. Not quite wedding material. I could not be happier. I couldn't be luckier to have met someone like Matt um, to spend for the week. Yeah. You only get married once, so it's got to be these. Stunning. Even though they cost more than my dress, <laughs> I'm just going to get them. Okay. Good choice. I'm just going to get them on my credit card, though, so Matt will never. <laughs> When you know, you know. So yeah, I'm really excited. I can't wait for the day. It's going to be awesome. Thanks, Thank Rose. You. All That's the best. Great. Enjoy it. Good I luck should... on your wedding day. <laughs> Thank you. See you. Bye. You'll see me again. Okay. Bye. Bye. Everything was going really, really well. I mean, apart from the green paint, that's going to be an easy fix. And we were so excited about this window seat because we thought it was a really good idea. And now it's just going to look stupid. They weren't what we ordered. They were completely wrong. <laughs> disappointing, very disappointing. Because everything was working. You know, there was a few hiccups here and there, but they were always be able, we were always able to overcome them. This one is just... You can't overcome can't it. Overcome this it's going to look stupid. We were so close. <clears throat> I can't think. Well, I came home with the shoes that I'd chosen um, and there was no way that Matt was seeing them before we got married. No! No! 
And one of the first questions he asked were, well, how much were they? How much? <laughs> Have a guess. $500. <sighs> so when he guessed $500 first time, I thought, no, it's time to have a bit of fun. So I said, hi. $1,200. More? <laughs> what? So when he got to 1500 I thought he was really freaking out. So I figured maybe I shouldn't go too much higher than that because he really might have a heart attack. 1800 1650 No. 17 Yeah. Whoa. Was anyone else shocked by that? So I did eventually tell him that they were only $500 which he was very relieved about. But of course, by that time, they sounded really cheap. <laughs> so my plan worked perfectly. Good one for all the chicks out there <laughs> who come home with a nice big package. <laughs> we need the two pillow covers, even if they don't have piping. Okay, you're saying we get your friend's mum to make just white covers just so we can get us through. I can try and ring her and see if she can just make two cushion covers if she's got white fabric, but if she doesn't... If she doesn't, she can go and get it in the morning. If she doesn't... Oh, well, we can go get it. Oh, we can, yeah, anything. Are you busy tomorrow? We just really need something that's going to look good and, and look of decent quality tomorrow. It doesn't have to last, that's the only thing. So, she's OK? Yeah, she only needs two or three hours. See, it doesn't take long. So if we can get, she can have them make maybe to us by two or three. And then she said she'll drop them down to us in Manly down here. Oh, she's the best. She's a lifesaver. The guy that was going to install the shower screen rings me at 10 o'clock today and basically tells me he can't. It's Saturday, I need the shower screen in by tomorrow. So I shoot down to Harvey Norman. Nothing in stock. So I was driving to another place and this van drove past me that said frameless shower screens. I think, no, nah, no, nah, it's stupid. And then the gods took over and I thought, this is an omen. You turn the car straight away, I'm in the truck. Chase after this guy, turn down this street and I've lost him. So I think, oh, well, I'll keep going to hardware and I'll do a U-turn and nearly hit his van. He's there, he's pulled over the side of the road. I ask him to help me out and he says, yeah, we'll get it done, no worries. Sort of, the shower screen goes in tomorrow. He's been sent by the gods from Melbourne. <laughs> oh, it's up about quarter to seven, six thirty. It's the painting that's the drama. Yeah, because it's white paint, you really do need at least three coats. But Stephen's thinking maybe we should put a fourth on. He doesn't trust me with the paint. <laughs> it's easier if I do it, because if Richard's in here doing it, I'll just be constantly telling him how he's doing it wrong. So if he just leaves me to do it, then there's no arguments. <laughs> what are you whispering? Nothing. Can I have the paint, please? We are under the pump today, let me tell you. We are. <laughs> we're going to be pushing. We've still got to get all our bits and pieces because we don't know what we're doing. The stuff that we got yesterday doesn't work. Because this isn't hooked in. Like when, when's the plumber coming? He said he was waiting. No, he said, he said that um, it's all right, Kirsten. He didn't want to come out. Yeah. Actually, just put it there. Is everything going to be done, Jason? It yep. needs to be done. Totally. Like, yep. does, Jared, I don't mean I had to do that with the plumbing. Yeah, yeah, we'll work it out. Like, what, what's wrong? Why isn't it done? No, no, it's well, not. Given that the plumber was here yesterday, why didn't he do it? Cursed. There's an answer I can't. Given the busy plumber. There's, there's some, <laughs> there was something, there were different views on how to do it, and they wanted to chat. That's no, all no. I know. So, is it going to be okay? It'll be fine. Okay. Well, I better go. Now, uh, good. Okay. <laughs> Bye, honey. Bye. Why did I park the car? It wasn't... Let me think about this. Oh, my God! <laughs> <laughs> Because nothing's open. So. <laughs> oh 
I wish I was in Bali <laughs> because there's just truckloads of this stuff. I just can't find what I need and it's just, I want something rattan. So don't buy the toothbrush thing, but we need a soap dispenser. Do you just want to get a proper, do you want a dispenser as well? What, what I'm asking you, Jace, is there's no, there's no natural fibre type wood stuff. So do you want me to get, do you want me to do the white? And what are they at? They're $119.95 for the set, so you get your plastic if you... Oh, we got the Sheridan, <laughs> and they're the same price. Do you have anything cheaper? You're breaking up, Jason, I can't hear you. Jason, I can't hear you. One more shower down the side is not going to kill us. Yeah, but... No, seriously. This is pony cam. <laughs> I know I'm a ball breaker, but... It takes hours to get it clean. I keep adding and adding and adding to the original ID. So the original ID can get it done in time. But as you keep adding and adding, you run out of more time. We've got to get these pillows, cushions to uh, my brother's girlfriend, Ellie, who's going to witness up some covers. That's a bit of a stress that we didn't really feel like having today. Hey, it keeps you on your toes. That's fun. Yep. Just need, we need them to look good for this afternoon. Okay. As soon as possible, I suppose. Okay. Yeah, no problem. Are we putting the whole pot in there? Yes. Why? Well, how are you going to do it? Because I just wanted little things just floating. That, that... I just think it'll look really dirty. That's why I got the little leaves to go over the top. <laughs> well, maybe we should keep this and grow it for another time. You, you've got to keep it in water. Which pond did you want to keep it in? Show me the little leafy things that you got. Oh, my God. I can't believe you thought we'd put this in the bath. Trent, look. This is like grotty. It's pond scum. Yeah, exactly my point. <laughs> I thought we were trying to make it like a pond. What's wrong with that? It floats on the top of water. Mate, that's, that's moss. P pond that's, scum? That's pond scum. Yeah, but it looked good on the water and it covered the bucket. <laughs> Get your own paint. <laughs> Oh, things are coming together okay. I don't know if they'll be ready by three. We'll just have to just see how we roll. If it's not ready, it's not ready. But, um, you know, we'll do our best to have it ready and looking good. I don't think I'm a good artist, but I love having a go. Oh, check it out. Pete. How long is it going to take you reckon to grab this? Um, it's going to take 15 minutes for the mirrors. I've got to call Brookvale Glass because they've got to come here and do the silicon. So what time should I tell them to be here? Oh, um, 10 minutes ago. <laughs> Thank you so no much. Luckily, we had a friend of the family come to the rescue and we paid her seventy dollars for the cushions. I can't believe she did the most beautiful job. The long one goes on that window. The other one. Yeah. Please fit, please fit. Yeah! Oh no! Oh no, they're too big! Oh no! They're supposed to be over there. Oh my god. It's bright, isn't it? We did it, I don't believe it. We did it! <laughs> Give me a hug. Yeah. Righto, guys, time's up. Come on out. Oh, here they are first, of Hello, course. Dude. Hello, Hi. good. Hi. Afternoon. Melbourne's not far behind. The new kids on the block looking a little weary. Well, I tell you what, guys, it's been another eventful couple of weeks here at the block. Probably for some more than others. Everyone here has had two weeks to put their room together. Jamie and Andrew, the new kids on the block, have had just one. So well done, guys. <laughs> Tremendous effort. And I cannot wait to see it. In fact, I'd like to see yours first. Yeah. Are you ready? Yeah. Let's go. Let's get into it. Go, yeah, guys. <laughs> Look a little tired, guys. Oh, 
Oh, I'm wearing a lipo. You are kidding me. Oh, guys, this is sensational. Well done. Thank you. Incredible, Thank incredible. You. Oh, I cannot believe it. How did you do this in one week? I know. This is obviously going to look fantastic at night. Can you yeah. throw those out? I don't want to see what this awesome. looks like. Look at that. Pretty cool. It, it had to cost you a mint. Did you spend a lot? Yeah, oh, I mean, we did. We went over budget. It feels warm and contemporary and really clever. Well done, Beachy. guys. <laughs> yeah, Tremendous you. effort. <laughs> Tremendous effort. I think you're going to do very, very well. All yours, Jamie. Welcome. Oh. Wow. This is beautiful. This is absolutely beautiful, guys. Can you feel yeah. a warm floor underneath? I, I was just yeah. about to say. Um, Does it feel delicious? Yeah. It's it's our it feels that. fantastic. And obviously that will kind of We've got some lovely warm, well. warm tech heated floors in at the moment. So in winter, more so than summer. You're, you're really... You yeah. know, you'll feel like curling up there at night. What a shame you guys won't be here to enjoy oh, it. I know. <laughs> and I guess one of the other features, we again, a signature, we've just got tons of storage. So, you know, on both sides, that is great. Another double storage over this side, so his and hers. Fantastic. Oh, have a look at this. This is amazing, guys. You like? Yeah. Yeah. We Very like it too. beautiful. The shower has almost become the kind of feature. It's the it? feature, yeah. 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 yeah, water feature. The design. <laughs> is it big sinks? And you've got the two, you know, the two vanities on either side of the shower. Fantastic, isn't it? Yeah. yeah. Uh, I always, I always sit, like to sit on the throne too, guys. If you don't mind. <laughs> <laughs> this little test job. It's How does it feel? Oh, fantastic. <laughs> <laughs> Very nice. Toilet paper in reach. Yeah. yeah. Well done. No, good. That's good, good access. Good access. <laughs> oh, well done. Yeah, good good effort. Well Thank done. You. Thank you. Excellent. Good. 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 Thank well you. done. Excellent. Yeah. This is amazing. What have you done with the floor? It's a concrete floor that we just poured over the timber surface. Yeah. It's a self-leveling compound, actually, and then we've just waxed it. It's That's beautiful, amazing. isn't it? Yeah. And also being near the beach, we just thought timber might scratch up a bit. So it's easy to clean. Yeah, I love it. And a bit more of your art. Yeah. yeah. Fantastic. There's two pieces. Sort of inspired by of course. construction sites. <laughs> <laughs> This is beautiful. This is really beautiful, guys. But wait, there's more. Yeah, because this is our second bathroom. Oh, wow. We've got a laundry in yeah. here. You've got a laundry in here. Washer yeah. and dryer. Yep. Huge bath. We Incredible. also thought that it was important to fit the bath in. We thought yeah. that added heaps of value because yeah. we are making a three bedroom apartment. Yeah. Yeah. People with kids may want to buy this and you need a bath. What did you guys spend on this? We it was good time. actually. What are we no, about? we're at about 9.4. Yeah. Which is, right? we budgeted for about 12. I've got to say, it's right down my alley, guys. Yeah. It's beautiful. Really good. beautiful. It's quite Can you come and do though. my bathroom? Yeah. <laughs> well, guys, four weeks ago, you all moved into a construction zone, or some of you even more recently, only a week ago. And what I've just seen today are the beginning of four incredibly beautiful, stunning homes. Congratulations. Woo! Yeah, well done, guys. You should all be extremely proud of yourselves. I'm not only impressed, but I'm inspired. Go see for yourselves. The block is open for inspection. It smells nice in here. They've had oils burning. Oh my God! The idea of two separate basins and in between the shower is just, just such a fantastic concept. You're going to be hard pressed to beat this. It's amazing. I just don't know about not having a door. That's the only thing. What do you think? <laughs> I don't know about the, the yellow bit road. The other thing is the toilet. But when you first walk in yeah, and you sort of have your space. legs hanging out. Is there a door? No, there's not a door. 
It's a really great design. I really like, I like it. No, I, I, I can't get over the toilet in the doorway. I just, that's just me. Oh. oh, lovely. This is the concrete floor they poured last night. Lovely. That looks great. Isn't that great? Very, very nice. Similar shower head. It's cosy. <laughs> it's very Jane and Matt. They might win this one. Oh, I wouldn't be counting chickens too early. Oh, wow. I love the tiles. This is really nice. Yeah, I love the tiles. They're huge. And there's, oh, okay. Oh, nice. Very nice. Very clever. For a small area, they've used it well. I probably would have had some more storage closer to the basin. That's the only thing. Well, you know when you're at the basin, you're shaving and stuff, you don't want to have to yeah, come all the way over here mess. and grab your stuff and then go back. That's the only thing. Oh, like Bali. <laughs> Doesn't it remind you of Bali? <gasps> Can you believe they had that done so quick? No. <laughs> this laundry is what knocks us out. Do you know what I mean? Because there's a laundry here with just more value. Sweet. Yeah. Oh, wow. Holy <laughs> mackerel. <laughs> My God, they must have spent a fortune. I wish I could find something wrong with it. <laughs> <laughs> the ties in with the cushions. Well, they've got oh. their telly. See, I think telly's bad in the bedroom. Not good for the love life. Gosh, they did well in a week. They did awesomely in a week. Yeah. It's so them. How impressive are these guys? They come in, they've got a week, and they nail us. <laughs> <laughs> good on them. This is fantastic. Of course, they look at look that. Look at that. That's fantastic. Oh. That's, they've just put a bed base down. And then they've used, see the skirting boards? Yeah. They've used the same skirting boards, yeah. covered them with fabric. Yeah. What a great solution. Cheap as chips and works really well. This is my favourite. Yeah, the winners. <gasps> oh, look at the tiles. Jeez. Oh, wow. Oh, look at that shower head. That is the good. I know, I know you're convinced that it's nice to be able to stand here and not be under the shower, but if I'm under there, I'm thinking, you know, it's probably a bit cold, <laughs> maybe a bit hot. I've got to get all the way out. If it's a cold morning, I get cold again to just turn it up a bit and then get back under. Again, it's, it's a, a minor point. thing. It it's only ways. a minor thing. It's a point. Our bedroom kicks butt on these. <laughs> well, the floor's warm. Yeah. Do you reckon it's heated? I don't like the tiles. I thought I would. I don't like that. That's a bit too phallic for me. You don't think it's a little bit change room looking? No, I don't. Okay, now I'm gonna give you my honest opinion without being a total bitch. Mm -hmm. Look at that paint job. Oh my God, look. Oh, I love it. Mm. I do feel, and I hope they feel the same way, ours is better. <laughs> Next time on The Block. Go away. I don't like being made to feel like a sucker. See, this is what the block's doing to me. Having just finished their second rooms, everyone's feeling a little tired and emotional. I want to go home. The rooms are judged. Oh! Reminds me of a five-star hotel. Uh, overall, I think this is one of the better rooms I've seen. <gasps> the standards are high. I think they've really lifted the bar a whole new level this week. Feels like they've captivated that whole feeling of manly. And the prize is awarded. The winners tonight are... Jeez. Meanwhile, a practical joke goes a little too far. <laughs> it's not mean. It's a game. We're having fun. I can only speculate as to who it may be, but I've got a pretty good idea. It's going to be hilarious when they find out. I am. Yeah. I, I just, I can't, I can't you, believe it. You, mate, settle Matt, down. Matt, then. Matt, don't tell me to settle down. I'm ready for a bit of biff. It is the lowest behaviour I've ever, <sighs> ever encountered. Let's do that. I don't think they saw the lighter side of it. I'm not